but it is super duper important to identify those abnormal mm. uh, rhythms so then you can let the provider know like hey as something, fast as you can as, yeah as quick as you can because there has been times um and this happens with uh, a lot of people that have been in the field is like they get a little bit complacent right and it has happened nobody's mm -hmm. perfect but um they kind of just brush over and they give it to the provider and not all the time the providers are they have other things that they're worrying about right right they have like 12 15 patients that they have to and deal they may with. not have that patient in front of them which, exactly. which is a really it's hard to look at a 12 8 ekg without having seen the patient because for me when i work intake like i just talk to that patient and i'm like i really want to see that ekg as soon as it's done because i'm like they look like they're having yeah, a yeah and um i think because you you've seen me like doesn't matter if they're a pa or an mp like I try to make sure that you guys are in the loop because you guys are the provider at the moment. You guys are, you guys are figuring out what to do with that patient. Yeah, yeah. So like the way it works at one of our hospitals is it's always an APP in the front.